This is question 16. Here I'm told that m is directly proportional to l cubed. Then I'm told that when l is equal to 2, m is equal to 160. And I'm asked to find the value of m when l equals 3. So when I'm given a statement about direct proportion, what I want to do to begin with is just write down a statement of proportionality. And what I can say is that m is proportional to, so that symbol there just means proportional to, l cubed. Now, what that means is that I can multiply a number by l cubed to give me m. And in order to find out what this number is, I'm going to set up an equation. So I'm going to just write down that m is equal to k multiplied by l cubed. So I can multiply L cubed by a number, and that will give me M. That's essentially what this idea of direct proportion means. Now, in order to find out what this number, what this constant is, that I can multiply L cubed by to reach M, I'm now just going to substitute in these two values. So M is equal to 160. And I'm saying that 160 is equal to this number that I'm trying to figure out, multiplied by L cubed, which in this case is 2. So I'm just using that information that they've given me here. What I can then rewrite this as, I can now say that this is 160 is equal to K multiplied by 8. Well, K multiplied by 8, I can write as 8K. Now, in order to find out what this value of k is going to be, all I have to do is solve this equation. 160 divided by 8 is going to give me 20. So I now know that in order to figure out what m is going to be, I would just have to multiply l cubed by 20. So I'm going to rewrite this as a formula. m is equal to 20 multiplied by L cubed. Let's just tidy that up. So M is equal to 20 L cubed. Now, what I'm asked to do is I'm asked to find the value of M when L equals 3. Well, now that I know what the relationship is between M and L cubed, I know that uh, M is equal to 20 lots of L cubed. Well, I just have to substitute L cubed into this formula. So I can say that M will be equal to 20 multiplied by 3 cubed. So 20 multiplied by 3 cubed. That means that I can say that M is going to be equal to 20. 3 cubed is 27. So 20 multiplied by 27. And so I can say that M will be equal to uh, 540. So my final answer there is going to be that M is equal to 540.